Hello everyone, my name is Sanindya Saraf. I hail from Mumbai, Maharashtra and I have been selected to represent India at the International Olympiad of Astronomy and Astrophysics. Of course, it is a very proud moment for me, my family and my teachers and I am extremely proud of it and I wish to get a goal for India. So these Olympiads are pretty different from the regular school curriculum which all the students have to see. They are more on a practical side. They expect you, you to use critical thinking, out of the box thinking and like something which you, you're not taught. You have to think things, you have to discover things and you have to create things while solving those questions. So that is the best part about it, which I like the most. Exactly, they are not promoted a lot because of the thing, because they are pretty different. So that's why I came to know about them from my teachers at Narayana. Previously, these Olympiads are pretty much different and that like since my childhood, I was pretty much intrigued by some critical thinking questions and I always wanted to give exams which tested critical thinking and they were a perfect match for that. Apart from that, I al always wanted to have a prestige of representing my country at an international stage. It feels, you feel proud to do that. There are primarily four stages in these Olympiads. The, it starts with the National Standard Examination in Astronomy, which is a national level exam. And like the cutoffs are state-wise, her state ka, there is a different cutoff. From there, few people are selected to, rep to give the Indian National Astronomy Olympiad. It is also a national level Olympiad, but now the cutoffs are same for all the people across India. And then they select 35 students to represent, to be a part of the o o camp, the orientation come selection camp. And over there, there are pretty, like finest minds of India and it is a very wonderful experience. So over there, there are pretty tough tests and after all those things, they select five people to represent India at the IOAA. So apart from astronomy, I've also been a part of the Informatics Olympiad, the Maths Olympiad and the Junior Science Olympiad. So I had been a part of the Astronomy Olympiad and I'll be very honest, it's pretty very different from what we learn at our school curriculum. So I have discovered a lot of things. I have discovered about how to use a telescope, how to point at stars, messiers, objects and so much things. Matlab, like the entire night sky is filled with so many objects, kisi ko bhi point kar sakte. So I think so I've discovered a lot. So Narayana has helped me in my journey since the first stage itself. The teachers like completed a lot of almost the entire syllabus which was required for NSEA and took my doubts. The material was also very great. For INAO as well, they had taken the workshop in which they had pretty much taught everything which was required for that. And for the camp stage though, they had taken efforts like anything. Matlab, I remember we had gone to Ahmedabad, the run of Kutch, and over there we started at 7 p.m. and then like the entire overnight we were doing stargazing observations. It was a fun experience and we slept at 7 a.m. in the morning. So the only message I would like to give is that the growth in Olympiads is not a linear growth. It's an exponential growth. So minus infinity to zero tak so one ka increase hota hai, uske aage, it will be a very high growth. So you don't have to lose your hopes when you are not able to grow. Apart from that, agar if you are interested in critical thinking type questions, out of the box thinking questions, this is a must. And thoda, in the beginning, everybody finds it tough, but after that it becomes way easy and matlab, kar sakte. Thank you Narayana.